A popular rock band is using the Zia symbol front and center on its new album. But as Action 7 News reporter Laura Terrain tells us, Zia Pueblo officials here in New Mexico aren't too happy about it. It's a story you'll see only on 7. It's a symbol New Mexicans know and love, the Zia, and it originated here on Zia Pueblo, where Governor David Pino says the image is so sacred, only medicine men are allowed to use it during ceremonies. Only the, the tribal leaders use that. I myself as a governor don't have actually any right to use the sun symbol. But now a rock band from Los Angeles called Bad Sons is releasing an album with a Zia right on the cover. Pino oh, yeah. says no one ever contacted the Pueblo before the symbol showed up. We like for them to ask permission and if they could donate some money to the scholarship fund. Pino says Southwest Airlines asked permission before debuting this plane. KOAT did the same for Sky 7 and our satellite truck. As this sign says, the Zia Pueblo is the home of the sun symbol and the governor just wants anyone who uses that symbol for profit to at least ask permission. What I usually ask him is to go ahead and write it in paper and give us a letter. Once we see the letter, we give it to our uh, in-house attorney. He reviews it. We reached out to the band and its representatives. The booking agency said this is their own interpretation of the image. The Zia symbol has three lines. Our logo is four lines and is altered. But as all New Mexicans know, the Zia does have four rays on each side. Governor Pino hopes the band will reach out to the Pueblo and ask for its blessing. After all, he does like their music. Yeah, sounds good. Laura Torrain, KOAT, Action 7 News. And in our response, to the band's booking agent, Action 7 News pointed out the Zia does in fact have four rays, not three as they claim, but we haven't heard back since.